I want to speak especially about education, which is very close to my heart, and it uh, really needs transformation. We want social justice in all of our educational uh, system, the educational structure, from primary through secondary through higher education. We want social justice. Our universities still present a very wide picture. They are often white bulwarks in societies that are becoming ever more diverse. Amsterdam, for example, a super diverse city where more than 50% of the youth uh, under 19 years of age is of color, black migrant or refugee. Yet at the university, we only see 13% of such students. Something is going awfully wrong there. Then when we look at the curriculum, it is drawing mostly on white males, sometimes dead white males, uh, but however, they're white males. Uh, it is very rare to come across the scholarship of uh, people from the South, either men or women. It's very rare. Um, I think it is important to make a change there. If we want to prepare students for the diverse and mixed societies that they are going to function in, they need to have more awareness of the, of the societies that they will be functioning in. A last point that I would like to make is uh, the connection between epistemologies and politics. I have shown in the talk that I have just given that in gender studies the concept of, of gender is thoroughly suffused with race. We don't often pay attention to that. I think I'm the first one to remark upon it that there are three sides where women are being studied. Gender studies, studies white women. Then there is ethnic studies, studies women of color, uh, black refugee, migrant women. Then there is uh, special institutions that study women from the south, third world women. These three sides act as if they don't have anything to do with each other. but. Race is the dividing criteri criterion that sets them apart. The same organization we find at the level of ministries, paying attention to women. Again, the same tripod we find there. So what we have to conclude is that race is very much at the basis of our knowledge. Our knowledge is suffused with race based on our more than 400 years, sometimes in the case of Portugal, 500 years of colonial rule, of imperial rule, I should really say. So we have to come to terms with that. We need to become aware of it and make it part of our scholarship.